Well, welcome back to Morning Break. You know, when it is as hot outside as it's been, sometimes you're not in the mood for a full meal, but right. still need something <laughs> to keep going, and juicing has become a very popular alternative. Yes. Shante Hazel and DeAndre Saab opened their first juice bar in downtown Savannah a month ago today, did yes. you say? Well, a yesterday. month ago today. Yesterday. yesterday. Unbelievable. Yes. Yes. And brand new business <laughs> here in town, and on National Refreshment Day, they're here to show us one of their really cool popular options from their Rejuicinate Juice Bar. Good morning, how are you? Good, Good morning. morning. Uh, first of all, I love the name. Thank, Thank you. <laughs> and it's very fitting for juicing because I'm sure you're playing off Rejuvenate. Exactly. And, and yes. the, they're very refreshing, they're very nutritious, uh, and you can really control what you put in them when you're making them fresh like that this, That is right? correct. Yes. No mm -hmm. sugars added, so it's definitely something that we can control. Yeah. Yeah. Good for the body. I'm yeah. so glad you said that because, you know, juices have become very popular, but with younger people, it's often really sugar-filled right. juices. Correct. And, uh, it's almost like a dessert that they're Correct. having. Right. Yours are not like that, very mm. natural. All so natural. natural. Fantastic. All right, uh, how big is your menu and uh, what are we gonna be making off of it? Ooh, well, this is going to be our rehydrate. Um, it's one of our new items off the okay. menu. Um, and we have a lot of items, actually. We got eight signature cold press drinks, and then we have about two or three that we added recently. Right. So. so they're like seasonal drinks because some of the fruit you can't get right. unless, you know, like during the summertime. Sense. So we have the three that's seasonal drinks. So that's so mostly fruit based, and then um, you'll drop a, a vegetable in there once in a while. Yes, yes. <laughs> I'm big on the vegetables. One, right. One, one two as well. Yes. So. Yes, exactly. <laughs> All right, so. so this is our rehydrate. And yes. how are we going to do that? So we're, this, we're going to use our um, personal juicer, mm -hmm. um, AMZ Chef. Got it off of Amazon for about really? for less than $150. No kidding. Yeah. So it's we really love really, this. We love it. We um, love it. When we first started juicing, this is actually what we use. And it's still rocking with us today. So. <laughs> <laughs> um, so in here, we've got our watermelon, our cucumber, apple, um, and our lemon and our mint. Mm -hmm. Nice. So cucumber is something that really just kind of brightens everything, doesn't right. it? Yes. And it's very, very rehydrating along with the watermelon. Yeah, it has a lot of water. It's all water. Yeah, yeah. Right. exactly. <clears throat> and I noticed the apples, uh, you're putting them in peels at all. You, yeah. you don't even have to peel these. No. Nope. Mm -mm. Okay. And you know, a lot of times with fruits and vegetables, the skin has a lot of the nutrients in it. So right. like, you don't want to always take the skin off when you're um, juicing. And you know, with apple, you need that fiber. So. This drink is very um, rehydrating, mm -hmm. hence the name. <laughs> very refreshing. Um, a lot of the ingredients in the drink um, is composed of mostly water, so it will keep you hydrated. Um, it's good for your skin. Oh, really? Yes. Pineapple going in there? Yes. There's so much water and liquid and good, good liquid in fruits mm -hmm. that that's where all this good stuff is coming that's from, That's where right? it's coming that's from. And coming you know, from. This, the fruits that are sweet. So it gives you that, that sugar, that sweetness that a lot of people are looking for um, as well. And so this other container here is capturing the what pulp. you won't use. But then yes. you, can, you can probably recycle that in some in other things. You can. And actually, I like to eat the pole. Do you really? <laughs> yeah, <it does. laughs> it's really good. And it's together. You can just take it and eat it. You can freeze it. And um, you can do a lot of things with the pulp as well. You probably could make some like dried fruit out of it. Yeah. yeah. You know, make that you know, uh -huh. really intensely sweet. Um, and I have thing. also dehydrated it where to where I can make powder out of it. Right. So you can just put it in water and drink yeah. it that way as well. Yes. Yeah. So you mentioned that you were doing juicing before you opened the place downtown. Mm -hmm. um, where were you doing that and, and for how long? We've been doing that in the kitchen for about two years. Just at home? Yeah, yeah just at, at home. home. It's a personal hobby of ours, but it's also because our family members, some of them have health issues, oh, okay. and we, we get to discussing on, like, how can we help them, like, you know, um, get rid of some of their pain, and just a lot of extensive research. We would travel right. and, you know, go try different juice bars right. and right. stuff like that. So we was like, Savannah doesn't really right. have Savannah it. Savannah doesn't have it. Juice no bar. Yeah. And, yeah. and I know right. people who were looking for them, yeah. so, you know, everybody's yes. always looking you, for something you new. You get a lot and, like, of smoothie. Um, shops and right. everything like right. that. And and that's right. Sometimes right. a little closer right. to dessert. Exactly. Right. Right. But, uh, but you both come to this from really fascinating backgrounds, I think. Yeah. Uh, just tell us a little <laughs> bit about that. <laughs> well, um, I have a, a BS in behavior analysis and then I also have a master's in social work. So I work with individuals with developmental disabilities and mental health. So I come from a real background. Well, always with people. So right. I'm back to doing customer service, but just in a different form. Right. And? and I come from a law enforcement background. Um, I worked for Savannah Police Department for 10 years. I was a sergeant for four. Um, I have a master's of business administration 
um, and uh, emphasis in project management. Right. So, so also still very involved yes, with the public. Right. Right. And, uh, you, public you got service. there, you saw exactly. the community exactly. and, yes. and probably had heard exactly. all the things that Savannah right. was looking for. Correct, <laughs> correct. So, so it's still good to see, right. you know, the, the many faces of yeah. the people that I've interacted with correct. over the years. So. Well, how's the first month gone? Oh, oh awesome. <laughs> it's very, it has been challenging. But at the right. same time, it's been rewarding. Like yeah. it has to see the smile on people's face, and they've right. been so welcoming, and you know, just being they're excited to have the juice bar here. Yeah. So it's just it's been great. Yeah. Yes, and it's really we want to let great. folks know that you were on the corner of it's Drayton and no, no it's uh, Mc Gas 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 Montgomery. Montgomery. Mm -hmm. uh, Five Five one. Right, yes. everybody knows right across the street from Hollingsworth. Correct. <laughs> okay, yeah, there you go. Yeah. Right across. Once <laughs> you told me that, I said, oh, I know exactly. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Once you mention that, most of the time they're like, okay, yeah, I know where you guys are. But you get a decent amount of foot traffic by there. So the color is interesting because it, it has taken on all the colors of, right. of all the fruits. It right. Has. It has. And Same typically color. like the juices that we have in the store, they're more commercial ju juices, right. they're cold press juicers. So you won't see a lot of um, what you see now. Right. Um, there's no pulp, there's nothing in the right. um, juice. Right. So. And then sometimes it just depends on how um, mm -hmm. color filled your your ingredients are. Mm -hmm. You see with the, right. this, this isn't, it's like a faint red mm -hmm. or whatever, but the more red that the watermelon is, then that's it. So and this is the rehydrate you said, that right? Is. The rehydrate. So in addition to tasting great, there's a lot of health benefits to this, exactly. and especially in the heat that we're having now. That is of correct. Course. This is what something wants, people want to come in and have this in the middle of the day. They, they do. do. <laughs> yes. Smells good, doesn't it? <laughs> That's great. That's you good. Like that is, yes. I can see Thank myself you. walking downtown Savannah and, uh, not feeling that like it was 95 degrees. <laughs> right. <laughs> Especially with a cup of ice added to it. You juice yes. today. Juice yes. bar. Guys, congratulations on getting Thank this. You. Thank you so much. It's going to be a huge Thank hit in our you. town. Yes. Thank you. Thank we were waiting Thank for you. it and ready for we'll it. We received that. Yes. Thanks so much for coming in this morning. Thank you for having us. Yes. Appreciate it. Well, coming up, a local nonprofit is getting kids ready with a back to school event this weekend. But as Kyle will show us, this is just part of a much bigger mission for the front porch in Savannah.